So let's quickly look at some of the minifigures before we get to the sets. One of the minifigures here is Cole, and I feel like his design really looks cool. I like the black, orange, gold, and gray that they put all mixed up. It really looks cool. The suit does look like the suit that we got for season 13 of Ninjago. Just, of course, we have without the tank and a few details changed here and there. Now, there are many people who don't like the mask, but I think the mask really look cool. But the only thing that I have against them is that they can't stand alone without there being a shorter pet piece. And also the Dragonian Warriors, which will be another group of minifigures that we're going to be getting, and a whole new species that we're going to be looking at in Ninjago Dragons Rising Season 3. So the original design was going to be blue and red, but looks like it was changed last minute to red, dark red, and silver and it looks like there are two types of them there are ones that can fly and there are foot soldiers or generals one with mohawks you know mohawks shoulder pad pieces and a sword like i said about both the mask and the different type of dragonian warriors you can find in 71823 kai's dragon spin jitsu which is 454 pieces and will be retailing for ten dollars so i don't know if you guys know this 71834 zane's ultra combo mech 1187 pieces will be retailing for 100 dollars and will be coming out january 1st 2025 this set literally looks like it's a transformer set i love how ryu's wings kind of like attaches to the, the set and it looks like Ryu himself is attached to it which is really cool and I hope maybe they can show that in the show how there's a mech that Ryu can actually use his wings in but other than that there's not really much to say about the set other than I hope it comes with more than one minifigure because for a hundred dollars this set I don't know if it's worth it but I don't want to say anything now I want to wait until we get official images but so far this set looks cool 71830 Kai Storm Rider Mech 333 pieces and will be retailing for $40. This set literally looks like it's a cross from Kai's mech that we got for the core season of Ninjago and Nia Strider that we got for the Lego Ninjago movie, just mixed up together with bulky pieces and stuff like that. There's not really much to say about this. I, like, I feel like it's an interesting build, but when it comes to how cool and if it's actually worth 40 bucks. I don't really know what to say. Again, I want to see some official pictures before I to give you guys my true thoughts on what it is. But I don't know, guys. This is something that you have to tell me in the comments down below. Because for me, I'm kind of mixed on this. And I'm not going to say anything until I see the official pictures. But... Hey, the minifigure selection looks great, so yeah, moving on to the next one. Next, we're looking at 71832 Storm Dragon, and this one set will be coming out in March 2025. This set is phenomenal. I love the build and design that went into this set. The gold, red, purple, mixed up colors, it's just phenomenal. The minifigures are also great as well. We get Eren, Sora, Lloyd, Nia... Not and a Dragonian Warrior, which is really cool. Especially not. I love that we're getting a Forbidden Five character. And Nia and Lloyd's mask really look cool. And they also remind me of Season 11 Forbidden Spinjitsu. But this dragon is phenomenal. And also one thing that I've noticed is that there are two clear swords, which could have a huge role in Ninjago Dragon's Rising Season 3. But tell me in the comments down below what you guys think. Last but not least, we have, we have 71829 Lloyd's Forest Dragon, 128 pieces, retailing for $20 and will be coming out January 2025. There's not really much to say about this set. It's a $20 set. There's not really much to see here. Here, but it, I have to say it does look good. I love the design that they put in the dragon's head that Exclusive golden drag the yellow golden dragon looks phenomenal. It really looks good Can't wait to get them to my collection but I have to say, for 20 bucks, you're getting a good deal. You're getting a type of Dragonian Warrior and also Lloyd and an exclusive dragon as well. Tell me guys in the comments down below what you think about these leaks and which set you're going to be getting. And I'll see all of you in the next one. Goodbye.